What's up, Jigster crew? Welcome back to another video. What did you guys think of last week's video? You guys digging the new 4K 20 frames per second, 24 frames per second? I think it looks a lot better. And personally, I enjoyed doing that challenge. So much so that I think I might actually try to start doing videos revolving around first tries or one tries or one takes, whatever you want to call it. Where I want to see if I can make a video, you know, same challenge, same thing as a challenge. The typical length video that I usually make, about 11 minutes. You know, no editing really, just one full straight talk. But before we get this video started, Let's run that intro. So right now I think I'm going to head over to Psycho Gear. And just go look at gloves maybe. This one's got a hole in them. Don't know how I did that, but did it. But you can see it's a nice beautiful day out, man. I had to come out and ride. Last week I couldn't really ride because, you know, it rained a shit ton here. I think there was literally one day it didn't rain and I didn't go ride. But man, guys, if you guys enjoy the content, man, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to like the videos. It shows the YouTube algorithm that I'm doing a good job. Over the weekend I was going to go buy a Grom. But right now we do live with my in-laws, so I do not really have the space, even though, you know, Grum's small, but right now we are also looking at tr trying to move out and get our own place, and moving a motorcycle, two cars, a bunch of bed stuff would be kind of annoying, so I'll hold off on the Grum for a while. But let me know down below, would you guys actually like to see a Grum? on the channel would you like to actually see content of me learning how to get into stunting starting from the bottom not really knowing how to wheelie I can wheelie a quad because if you're interested in it I can maybe justify getting one and I also thought about maybe doing content with the fucking RS I don't know if you guys are really interested in it I know this is a motorcycle channel but for my eyes I kind of want to do everything you know motorcycles a little bit of cars some point I want to get into dirt bikes again. Was there something you guys also might be interested in? You know, getting a look at the RS. And I am currently working on my pant review. I'm trying to get everything scripted out and written so I'm not, you know, doing that uh, uh, like I do a lot of. So that one's coming soon. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I'm gonna park over here away from everybody and everything. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm gonna walk around this place for a little bit and see if I can find any gloves. I'll get back to you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, we're back. I uh, ended up buying these freaking Spirit 2s or whatever. They're like 20 bucks, so we'll give them a shot. I'm, so, I'm used to riding like like motocross, like dirt bike gloves. So if I can like street, regular street gloves, just they feel awkward. <laughs> they feel so weird. It feels weird going from uh, dirt bike gloves to normal street gloves. I crashed with those fucking dirt bike gloves and I put my hand down. I don't think they're going to save me from the fucking sidewalk or the concrete. A little shortcut. Oh yeah, that's another thing I forgot. I'm actually also looking into getting a P.O. box. So I can do sticker exchanges with more of these small YouTubers I'm in the group with. But I don't really feel comfortable about giving out my home address. It's not like I don't trust these guys. It's just, you know, feels a little bit more safer to have a P.O. box. The beauty of motorcycles. 
I'm gonna go to that abandoned hotel and take some pictures, a thumbnail, maybe record my tic some TikToks over there. <gasps> oh my God, puppy! Puppy! Oh, hi. you're so pretty. Are you kidding me? That's whack, bro. That's whack. They fucking boarded it up. Nah, oh, that's bullshit. I was gonna record TikToks at this fucking hotel, but they are de demolishing it. I'm assuming. I know a lot of homeless people like to hang out in this one. So. I mean, I wouldn't really be all that surprised if they were demolishing it. It's been abandoned since shit, I moved here. Of course, guys, I forgot to put the freaking. I'd be pissed if the thing fell out of my pocket. I mean, it wasn't really all that expensive, but it would still kind of suck. Take me with you, I'm trash. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys have a fantastic week. Be safe out there. Apparently, a lot of people are getting sick again because of COVID. I mean, it's been almost two years, but clearly, people don't learn. But yeah, I'll see you all next week with another adventure. Peace.